This is the Carbon Flyer, the world's first super tough, super fast, Bluetooth controlled carbon fiber drone. The Carbon Flyer is the ultimate tech toy. We've created a revolutionary plane using actual carbon fiber. We've equipped the Carbon Flyer with twin high output motors, a long range Bluetooth control module, LED running lights, and an onboard camera. Carbon fiber is 10 times stronger than aluminum. It has 100 times the strength to weight ratio of steel, and it is more than 1,000 times stronger than the toughest foam. This prototype right here impacted the side of buildings and concrete surfaces over a dozen times at high speed. Carbon Flyer can be controlled up to 240 feet away using either an Android or Apple smartphone. Bluetooth allows for a two-way communication with the plane, providing real-time battery and connectivity status. Our interactive app allows the pilot to control the plane's airspeed, altitude and steering using only one hand. From the very beginning, the carbon flyer was about the carbon fiber, the world's strongest and lightest material. We are pushing the boundaries with this nearly unbreakable flying toy. The carbon flyer is perfect for RC hobbyists, flight enthusiasts and gadget lovers everywhere. This is Airblock, a one-of-a-kind, programmable, transformable drone and hovercraft. Think you've seen a drone like this? Think again. Airblock is unlike any drone you've seen before. Start with individual magnetic pieces and 15 seconds later, you have a drone. Control the drone through the app via Bluetooth and take to the sky in no time. Airblock is amazing, not just because it's entertaining, but also because it's educational. It teaches kids, and big kids, about coding and aerodynamics. Use pre-programmed maneuvers within the app. Just drag and drop into action. Airblock caters to every type of drone pilot. Want to try your own moves? Program your own aerial stunts right in the app. Have some cool ideas of your own? Airblock allows you to DIY so you can build your very own creation from scratch. With Airblock, you're not just constrained to the air. Take to the land or sea by transforming your drone into a hovercraft and hover over smooth ground or even over water. 
Rookie killing your vibe and your drone? Totally fine. Airblock is tough, so you can fly and bump into obstacles without fear. The engineered plastic foam makes Airblock durable, so it's safe to fly indoors or out. Snap into action and keep flying. So who's behind this awesome product? We are. And who are we? Makeblock. We've launched and shipped four products on Kickstarter and have grown from just three people to a team of 200 people today. We've got 400,000 users and still growing. In the past four years, we've established ourselves as the company that encourages STEM-based education through our DIY robotics and products. We're passionate about bringing DIY robotics and STEM-based programming and education to folks like you. We need your help to get Airblock off the ground. So back to the point. You want a programmable, transformable, crashable drone? We'll make it easy for you. Back our Kickstarter campaign. And the best part? It's affordable. Because let's face it, everyone should have Airblock. Support the cause and get your own. Airblock. Code to fly. Is it a bird? A plane? Nope. It's the world's smallest spy cam. And today, near Oslo, Norway, this team is taking it farther and faster than it's ever gone before. Something we have tested many times, but not from that far out and, and that high. Paul is the drone's target. He's going to hide about one kilometer away at the top of a small cliff leaving time for the rest of the team to give the Hornet drone, officially called the PD-100, the once-over. Check the system, see that GPS, everything is, is up and running. Each one weighs only 16 grams. That's the same as three sheets of paper. Within the base station, we have not one, but two self-contained helicopters, which are ready to fly out of the box. Once we're ready to fly and we have the helicopter out, I can hold this here and put the pocket-sized base station in my back pocket. Ready to go when you're ready. Now I'm just heading out now. It quickly reaches a top speed of about 20 clicks. The smaller and lighter you are able to make it, the more difficult it is, of course, to, to detect. The drone is so stealthy, even our camera has a hard time finding it. But behind its playful appearance is a highly sophisticated military tool containing three cameras. It works actually like a, a pair of, of flying binoculars. The British military uses those flying binoculars to scope out snipers in Afghanistan. They also use it to safely preview what's ahead. Instead of going in with a lot of force, like blowing your way through your walls and stuff, you could stop a couple of hundred meters outside that area, launch the PD-100 and fly over and have a look. The concept came to Petter Muren when he was a kid. I still remember a dream I had that one day I would be able to build something small that could hover and something I could just maneuver around, land in my hand. Inspired by nature, his early models look like finely crafted insects from the future. One thing led to another and another and one day, Petter struck a deal with a toy company. Together, we developed the first successful indoor toy helicopter. The Blade Runner. It was very popular, and, and uh, if you include the Ill illegal copies from China, um, it's probably produced in many million copies. Use that dough to help start up Prox Dynamics. The total mission should last for anywhere between 15 and 20 minutes. This isn't a toy. It's for real combat. For today's test, they do a small rebuild. We put in slightly stronger motor. We have modified software. And today we, we were testing if these things actually gave more in terms of distance. Worst case, uh, we, we lose a helicopter. Each one costs tens of thousands of dollars. Engineered using Petter's miniatures. Instead of spending time on, on trying to to make a big thing smaller. We started out with something as small and as light as our target was. It gradually more and more features and, and capabilities put into it. GPS, gyroscope, wireless links, squeezing it all in is an exercise in nano design. It's pretty amazing uh, and the most challenging part of uh, this development. And there are engineering trade-offs. I'm a little bit concerned that 
as we approach the top, we may have a little bit of turbulence from the uh, wind yep, yep. striking in the thermals there. Wind can be a problem. So can you notice there that we have the side of yep. the, uh, the cliff there and we can use that for some visual guidance as well. Mission accomplished. They've located their target hiding on the top of the cliff. Now well, it's just a matter of getting it safely home. Yeah, that's uh, concentrating on that now. Can do a uh, full speed flight home. They punch in their GPS location and the autopilot will bring the drone back to base in record time. So um, we are pretty happy. We, we had been flying far out and, and high up, but uh, the combination is, uh, is uh, the first time we've been able to, to do. The Black Hornet went 1,300 meters. That's farther than ever before. But uh, still, it's uh, it's always uh, something to, to put in, uh, in the history book. Sometimes dreams do come true. There we go. Good. Hi, welcome to Power Up 3 the world's first smartphone-controlled paper airplane. To fly power up like a professional pilot, you'll need some guidance and initial setup instructions. With enough patience, you will soon turn your paper airplane into a lean flying machine. Before you start flying, choose the right location and the right day. Found them? Now you can start unboxing. Carefully unlash the rotating tabs that are fixed to the plastic base. After unboxing, keep all the materials together using the power up packaging as storage and a carrying case. Inside the box, you'll find a smart module, a micro USB cable for charging the smart module, extra propeller and rudder, the power up 3 user guide, four paper templates for easy flying, and one special waterproof template. Ready to move on? Let's move on to the next tutorial, Charging Power Up 3.